next to no time to get ready in the mornings, but here with two weekday doable hairstyles you can get done in five minutes is Jennifer Gutierrez. <laughs> Andrea and Victoria, uh, we are going to start with Andrea, yes, we and are. you're going to do this quick five-minute do that we can all do. Are you guys ready? Okay, we so ready. we are ready to dream big, you guys. Okay, okay. so what I'm going to do is first I'm going to use our new um, powder uh, spray in here. So this will actually give it a lot of texture. So especially for fine hair, really it's for any type of hair, but that will just give you that texture in there that you need. Um, is it like a dry, is it a dry shampoo? It's not a dry shampoo, but it will take away some of those oils in there. Okay. So it is a styler, and yeah. it will just give it that, that oomph yes. that you need, right? Because sometimes you, you need to be able to grab onto that hair, exactly. like a little bit of volume in there, so that the powder will help. So what I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to use my fingers. I try not to use too many tools, because honestly, we, sometimes we just don't have time for tools. Right. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to keep some hairs out of the way. Uh -huh. So I'm actually going to put her hair in a side pony, and this way it's actually easier for you to see what you're doing instead of having it at the back. Yeah, that's totally true. Yeah. Okay, so now I'm going to do a pony, but instead of going all the way, I'm actually going to uh, loop it just like this. Nice. Okay. So I'm going to grab my bobby pins. Mm -hmm. So and let me just turn you just like that. And so now with this loop, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to split it in half. There's something about doing anything that's sort of some kind of an updo that just looks fancy. Yeah. And exactly. it can be any day of the week. I mean, this is an easy this look to achieve, look. but it's going to look like you put some effort into your look. Okay, so now with the split of the loop, I'm actually just going in and pinning it at the base. Yeah, I feel ya. Okay, and then you're just gonna keep pinning, and then whatever's left, you're going to wrap it. And cover the uh, and elastic. And cover the elastic. Nice. achieve this look and uh, that was less than five minutes so you, we are winning right we now are winning. we are winning let's move on down to Victoria so we wanted a model with straight hair and then a model with curly hair uh, Victoria there's so much that you can do with her hair there's How are we gonna so switch much you it can up? do so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna do a modern-day French twist which is sounds Ooh, nice. scary but it's so easy to do especially with her texture uh -huh. but you could also do this with any type of hair. Uh -huh. As long as you have the right products, you're good to go. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to section out this top section right up here. All right. So volume is not her issue. Or you no. don't need to add any volume, right? I definitely don't. <laughs> the curly girls out there have, I mean, what's amazing about curly hair is that it often always has that oomph exactly. to it. So whatever you're going to do with it, it's going to look amazing. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to bring this all to the side. Uh huh. I'm gonna grab my bobby pins. I'm feeling a Sheena Easton 1980s <laughs> vibe, and I'm liking it. And I'm Apollonia. <laughs> so I'm gonna, it. I'm gonna start pinning uh -huh. all the way up so that there's a um, section like that, and you'll see all this hair to the side. So, so once we're again, we're doing a side in situation. Place. We're gonna pin everything in place. If you want me to be your assistant, I can help out too. Oh no, we're good, we're good. Now does she need, when you've got curly hair in the winter months, I think the issue is usually hydration, isn't it? Hydration is key. So as long as you have some kind of oil or a leave-in conditioner, yeah. that's the best thing. Okay. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm actually gonna start twisting all the way up, all this hair out of the way. Mm-hmm. I heard that, wow. <laughs> She's got it's a ton gonna happen. of hair. So twisting and twisting all the way up, just like that. And again, you're gonna start pinning at the base. This is beautiful, actually. So this is what a French twist is. This is basically a French twist. Okay. Without all the tools yeah. and all the, the fancy combs. Right. Okay. Although if you did have any of those big shell combs, that would help a lot with oh, the back, 100%, right? Oh, 100%, 100%. So I'm just gonna keep pinning this all the way up okay. until I run out of hair. <laughs> right. <laughs> Eventually I will. The key is also that it's not about super duper structure right now. Oh, this 100%. is about letting the hair be what it is and I exactly. think it's nice that we're in a phase where people are really embracing what they naturally have. Exactly. So if you have the fine hair, you deal with it. If you have thick curly hair, you deal with it and you sort of bring out the best of what you have. 
That's pretty. So then, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna finish it with our lightweight hairspray to nice. keep everything in place. And what's great about this is there's no flaking, yes. so you, it'll be amazing in your hair. And then, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. No, I was gonna say that's and it. And ta <laughs> done in real time so sure if, you, if you are at home you can get this done and get out the door and wow everybody at the office because with your fancy hair so Jenna